Hello, I'm this and that, and I'm back to playing The Last Door. And, um, a few things I should mention while this is loading, like, for example, um, console videos. Yeah, that will take a while to come back, I mean, I've looked at the that new computer a bit more, and, well, in, I guess it, graphics card might, internal one might not be a problem, but, um, I don't know, I, I'm still going to wait a little bit before actually recording a console video on there. Secondly, a bit of Last Door news. You see, yeah, it is now on um, Steam, Steam Dreamworks, that's it, for like the first three chapters bundled together, yeah. So I'd recommend going and thumbsing that up. In fact, I'll have a link to that in the description. Yeah. So, you know, you'll of course be able to buy the first three chapters, which I'd imagine could possibly go towards supporting the future chapters. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if that's where the money for that's going. So anyway, new game. Of course, I'm going to... Also, another thing I guess I should mention is that I'm going to try things a little differently. Beforehand, I would play the game first for myself, so I knew what to do. But this time, I'm going to go and try and do a more direct approach and see if I can handle that. So yeah, dark environment, light switch off. Gosh, it's dark in here. Bloody winter. Okay, so yeah, requires a that. I guess you can have that. God, that's dark. Uh, I mean, well. Wow. There we go. All is darkness. Oh yeah, of course I've been buried. Also, all is cold. All is silence. Oh dear, what's going on here? I actually know what's going on here, but how am I going to get out of this? wasn't even locked. Well, I mean, I guess you'd assume it'd be locked. I mean, really? It's trapped in a coffin and he didn't even bother to check to see if it was locked. Hmm. I could have skipped this, but instead I chose not to. Why? Oh, whatever. At least I get to see the beta testers. So I have them to blame if there's anything wrong. Ah, I'm sure there isn't. Well, yes, that's okay. Maybe I'm gonna donate. Okay, so yes, on to the story. Okay, where am I? Forest? Huh. And who's he? Oh, I see a flashback. Jeremiah, we must talk. With your mother deceased, arrangements have been made regarding for your upbringing. A man of my position and responsibility can't take the time to look after a young boy. First thing in the morning, you will depart for Scotland. I am sending you to study at St. Gal Balling School in Aberdeen. You need not bother to write, as I will not have time to read your letters. Actually, I don't know if he's saying that will mean, or it really doesn't have the time. Oh, well. That's up for your interpretation. Hmm. Ah, yeah, it's still no letters for you, Debit. Please do not persist any further. Look, he does not have the time for you, Debit. Honestly. Hmm. 
pleased to meet you, my new classmates. And who is that? Him? Oh, that's just Devitt. Pay him no mind. He's a little odd. Interesting. Well, if someone's a little odd, that means you must always investigate. Odd is fantastic. Remember that, viewers. So, yeah. Hello, I'm Anthony. Anthony Beatworth. This is my first term here. I've only just arrived. I hope we can be friends. Yeah, I just thought that'd be a little lesson to you viewers. I mean, you know, if someone seems a bit odd, investigate. So, now back here. What? What is happening? That is a very good question. A shiver runs down my spine when I looked at what could have been my eternal deathbed. Hmm. Yeah. My head is pounding. I feel so weak and thirsty. If I don't drink water soon, I will faint. Dear Lord, where am I? Well, read this. You might find out. I think. Eyes closed, ears muffles, and voices hush in a land that loves silence. Why did I assume that would... Well, oh, whatever. Right. Pipes, that's a hint. The light coming from outside is dazzling. Well, that must be some superb light. Oh, no. I thought there was something on the wall. Right, okay, moving onwards. Where am I? I mean, where is he? I know where I am. You don't know where I am. And that's good. Let's keep it that way. I'm in a city. Is it Aberdeen? How could I have escaped? And why were you taken here? I can't see anything beyond this wall but dark facades of buildings and far side facade? Oh. oh, screw it. Look, it just happens when you encounter words you don't often have to read, alright? Where the heck am I? Oh, this guy sells potatoes. I might need potatoes later. See, a young man. Please tell me where I am. Can you please tell me where? You're in Scotland. You know, given that no one wants to talk to you. Well, potato man. May I have a sample of your potatoes? Please, sir. Can you give me some water? This ain't charity tough. I only sell to paying customers that cough up or get out. Or get out! Oh, that ain't a voice actor. I'd need some kind of voice training or something. Oh, so he's supposed to be Scottish. Why the hell did I give him that bloody accent? He also says water, Chris. There's a water. There's a cart blocking the alley. I won't be able to pass it until it's been moved. That sounds like it's part of the puzzle. And in an indigent in so indi indigent? What the hell is an indigent? Oh whatever. In ragged clothing sits leaning against the brickwork. Yeah, it's staring. Whatever. Okay. The young man sleeps under a filthy blanket. Wow, we're really in the slums. Stained and threadbare sheets struggle to dry in muggy air. In the muggy air. A young woman shivers with difficult, shivers difficulty breathing. Hang on. Oh, sorry. A young man so a young woman suffers difficulty breathing. Oh dear. We really have hit the slums. Please, I need water. Get out of here, drunk. Seriously, why the hell is he drunk? 
There was a young man staring at me from amidst the crowd. Something in his co uh, countenance seemed strange to me. Probably because he doesn't seem like someone who belongs here in the slums. And he just buggered off. Say, uh, uh, please, ma'am, could you tell me where I am? I don't know where you're. You don't know where you're at? Why, this is old Nicole Street Rookery. A darker, more des desperate place like there never was. But I was in But that's in London. How could I have arrived in this slum? Oh, I see, so my accent was appropriate! Fantastic! So I know that guy just buggered off to. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to find out later, won't I? A pipe flows grimy water. F uh, uh, from the pipe flows grimy water, full of soot. Well, drink. Um, water's foul odor is repulsive, but I am overcome with thirst. Ah, uh, no, I just killed him. Fantastic. I might have fainted. It is dangerous to be in old Nichols at night. I should make my way out as quickly as possible. Yeah, you got a point there. So, London. That's a place. That everyone thinks of when someone says, Think of a place in England. Then they go, London. And then you go, Great. Can you think of anywhere else in Lon in England? Then they go, Brighton. And then you go, What do you know about Brighton? It's a place for the gays. To which you then go, Yes, but what else can you tell me about Brighton? To which they'll go, It's got a pier. No, I mean, there you go, it's got a pier. To which you then just sort of just give up on them. Hmm. It's all gone here. Flashback, perhaps? Her doctor, Wakefield. Her doctor, Wakefield, is here to see you, mine, her. Show him in, Hurts. Is it about your patient? It is it about your patient, is it not? There is no trace of him. He has not shown up for his last sessions. I have been to his house, of course. His landlady assured me he went on a trip weeks ago and hasn't come back home. He kept the destination to himself. Then it is happening as I feared. What do you mean? I am sorry, my dear friend. I first thought of this when you described your sessions with her, Devitt. But I didn't want to upset you without need, as I hoped for the best. Now I am afraid my suspicions could be true. There are some things that I will have to verify first, though. I promise that I will contact you as soon as I have learned everything impor anything important. Please, Herr Doctor, it is of the utmost importance no one else knows of this matter. I don't know how I've given them German accents since they're obviously German, but screw it. You have my total discretion. Chapter 4 The Four Witnesses. Right, so. Ah, sorry. I feel like I have been walking these streets for hours. Surely I must be close to finding my way out of this. Labyrinth. Well, that's the streets of London for you. None of it makes any bloody sense. A rusty old lamp sits empty in the corner. No, it doesn't belong to anybody. You're welcome to take it if you like. I'm not sure what good it'll do with you without any oil, though. That's awfully nice of you. I mean, I could need it. Could it's an adventure game, though? Though the ember looks as though they, they'll extinguish you, its meagre warmth is welcome. You can take the fire if you want. <laughs> nah. Did you hear him? The 
to crow, searching for the moans of the weak and dying. They're calling out to each other. They must have found something. Can you help me? The, the, he, the, street, the streets are so confusing to navigate. I'm afraid I've lost my way. Can you direct me out? Yes, yes, lost one. I can help your direction. I, I, I have been gifted with a second sight. I could peer deep into your past and unwind the tapestry of your fate. Would you like me to close my eyes and so that yours may be open? I haven't a penny to pay. Money is of no matter here. Come close to me now. I pick no one. The Walker. You have been embarked by a great you have embarked on a great journey, but this path has to be walked by you had been walked by you before. You step your own footprints inside the circle of fire. The mask. Empty eyes stare at you and a voiceless mouth calls you. Its lips twist and snarl with what has been what it has seen. What has still been seen. You think it's a stranger's face, but it is your own. The puppet. Threads hanging from an immersed hand of dust. Coverage amongst a single point. Your mind. Where the memories. Oblivions and shadows cluster as one. It is your friend and foe, your home and your prison. I don't understand. What does it all mean? I can't unpick these uns. The threads you have woven in your destiny are still too, are still too tight, child. But you will. Oh yes, you will. I can no more. That's that is not for me to say, but you will discover. No, well, sorry, that is not for me to say. What, but you, for you to discover. Remember that in the fog, we can only see what is closest to us. The bird remains in the distance. If you wish to leave, you must follow the path of the bird. No more direction can I give. Pardon me, I must go. You will need a map to guide your steps. Farewell. Okay, when am I gonna find a map? Ew, you look like a guy who has a map. Hey. What are you buggering off? You must keep my m Sorry, you may keep my miserable kingdom. You may keep my spirit. Spike encrusted jewels. Stay there as you will and stare into my eyes. I am a shadow's shadow and I will not disappoint. Alright then. Hey, what's down here? This is rubbish. Lost in scraps of food and discarded papers. Well, okay then. Well, I know that now. The glass is fogged over, but the hand, save for the handprint on the surface. Time for investigation. No. Grab it. No. Search for the click or kick up I think show up. It's very dark. I don't dare go on. I see what the lamp is for. Okay, fine. What's over here? In the fog. Um Right. This is some serious fog. I got lost in the fog. If I'm gonna make my way through, I'm gonna need to orient myself somehow. I don't know, would the lamp help? I think a lamp would help. Let's get a lamp. That's oil. Where the hell am I supposed to get oil this time in London? Hmm. Ah, I'm sure it shouldn't be too hard. I can see it from there. 
Yes, the street lamp tries to put some light into the gloom. Steal its oil! No? Fine then. Because why do I keep thinking I can right click and this is a flash game? Hmm. Little fly. Probably. Cuts of rancid meat lie discarded in the butcher's block. Oh, candles. Switches, actually. Uh -huh. Interesting. In oh, I see. It has a puzzle. They've got to get them all down. Remains of a horse hang by a hook affixed to the wall. Its blood drains seeping into the floorboards. What a horrible waste of a horse. Rusted out drums. Empty. Seriously, why would you want to eat a horse? There's plenty of other meats you could eat. Why horse? Then again, I guess this is the slums, so you know they eat anything out here. A bottle of gin. It's empty, but maybe of some use. Yeah, fill it with water and we'll claim we got some gin and trade it with a homeless person. This machine is old and in disrepair. It appears to be some sort of filtering machine despite its condition. It seems to have been used recently. Maybe a sign that we'll have to use it at some point. It's a glass embezzler. Liquids are poured into the top and in, then impure Impurities are removed through a valve at the bottom. Right. Purify this. No. Forget you then. Oh yeah, right. Of course, we are holding that. What's in there? Why the hell do I think I need to collect the blood from that? That's stupid. Like, no, why do I keep trying to use it on everything? I mean, that's what you're supposed to do in adventure games when you're lost, but I ain't lost yet. A boiled up window is a rundown house. Dust smears in the window. Uh, dust smears the glass, preventing me from seeing the interior. Oh, hey, can I claim that? No, 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 just coincidence. Very well. Anything else over here? Hey, I've been over here. It's a big old circle, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, so I'm now at that point of an adventure game where you're gonna stop and think. Right, I've got these things on me. What the bloody hell do I do with them? I mean, like, I can now go in here. But, and all I've got is this gin to prove it. Like, what the hell do I do with this machine? Yeah, some sort of filtering machine. Hmm. Obviously, I used the. It filled a bottle with something. And I filter it, and I got something I can use. Yes. Yes, that, that's the thing. But what the hell am I filtering? No, I'd stop doing that. It's obviously not a liquid. Hmm. Am I absolutely sure I cannot interact with that in any way? No, of course not. I haven't got anything to interact with it using. Oh, what in the name of buggery do I do now? Oh yeah, this is exactly the reason why I didn't do this before. 
because of the exploring part. The old good old thing of... Hang on, did I go... Oh yeah, of course, I tried going in here, but I could not go very far without any means of light returning that far. And again, I need to somehow figure out how to get oil. Where do we get oil? Bugger if I know. No, I don't get it from smashing that open. Gee, stop thinking about vandalism. Just because you're in London doesn't mean you have to act like you're from London. Okay. Oh, I'm allowed to make better people from London. I'm English. Yes. Okay, fine. Let's see if I just wandering around in the fog will find something. Right. Now we will venture on. Not any bloody idea where I'm going. What's the worst that could happen, right? Since when were there so many trees in London? I see. Very well, very well, very well. I will stop the video here and... But hang on, what's this locked for? Okay, it's shut. Can't be open from this side. Oh yeah, right, of course, now I know. Now I know. Anyway, yes, I will end the video here. Until next time, goodbye.